Hi, Anastasia. Hi, Anastasia. How are you? Welcome, everybody, to the Swatch Party. If you watch this in the replay, let me know which, um, which shades you like of uh, the colors of tonight's Swatch Party. If you're thinking about getting them after the Swatch Party. Hi, Sarah. Things like that, I would love to know. Don't forget to leave a like, leave a, uh, go on a subscribe, do all the good stuff. Um, so now with 2020, we will be doing a little formatting difference on lives since I do most things live. Um, so uh, what I'm going to do is be more mindful of the timing, which means that things like this will end when I am done with them, if chit chatting uh, will have to be in different times, different things, mainly because I need to make sure that I capture people who want to just see the products and not see two hours and say, hell no, I'm not going to look at this kind of stuff. So we're trying something a little different. So with that being said, tonight is swatch party night. Wednesdays are always swatch parties. And I like to swatch things that I got new. So today, what is going on with my eye right here? Oh, in the day, I'm looking a hot mess. Um, so I'm going to give till three minutes. So just so everybody knows who's watching the replay, we give them three minutes to give. And then the swatch party begins. So it's almost, so we're almost there. So anyway, uh, yeah, doesn't it look kind of swollen? Oh, man. So... Yeah, it's looking a little swollen, y'all. Just a little. Hold on, I'll be right back. Hello again, I roll around. Hi, crazy. Um, I don't know, something going on with this eye. We go, we go. Yeah, it's like right there. It's feeling kind of swollen. Probably because I still got my cold. The cold has never really gone away. That's why, hence why I'm not wearing any makeup. Ooh, this feels good. Crazy Taipei. Okay, hey, Janine. I'm feeling better. I'm not 100%. We just know it's my eye looks swollen. You see this? My eyes look swollen. Okay, so I'm going to have to go and get some cucumber on these babies. Because I am not going to be walking around like this. Not at all. Okay. Well, I got swollen ass today, so we'll just have to deal with it. Uh, probably because I'm, uh... <laughs> right. Yes, it's a jade roller. And I keep it by my win my open window to keep it cool. How I trust it. Oh my goodness, this side is cold. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Oh man, this feels good. Okay, well anyway, yeah, my eyes are a little swollen. All right, so let's get started and let's talk about it. So today, what we are going to be swatching, hi Coco, we are going to be swatching these. Um, I don't have that one yet. These are the L'Oreal Matte Lip Crayons. Uh, they just came out. These are kind of brand new. Uh, they just hit the market. So when I saw them come out, I had to get them. And if I'm going to do a swatch party, I have to have all of them. Hence why I don't do a lot of high-end swatch parties. Because I can't afford to buy a whole range of $30 lipsticks. Just not in my budget right now. Because if it was, I would do it for you. So anyway, I wound up paying... Um, I wound up paying $9 for these because I worked the system. So what I did was, and don't we love the, the Ulta system? What I did was they had a sale, buy two, get one free. These are $11.99 because we know that L'Oreal is on the high end of drugstore. So these are $11.99. They had them buy two, get one free. So I got all that. So I got four of them free. It was still 90 something dollars. Then I put on, um, then I did 20% uh, off because I had 20% off coupons. So that brought it down 
Then I had a $20 um, gift card. Boom. Took it down to like $50 or something. $50 something dollars. Then I used a thousand points. So I paid nine dollars and like 75 cents for all of these. So here we go. Let's get started. Now, of course, my lips are gonna be mad at us, but we're gonna get this done. So, like I said, this one is going to be straightforward. We're gonna get hey, Michelle, we're gonna get to it, and then we're gonna end it because I need to end these quicker than I used to. No chit-chatting for two hours on things like swatch parties, gonna get it done. And then, you know, chit chat is going to be, you know, chit chat, but not in when I'm doing something focused. So here's num the first one. This is number 500. This is Caramel Blondie. I think they have a scent. Yes, they have a slight, kind of almost honey scent. But here they are. So this is Caramel Blondie. Y'all can tell me which ones y'all like, which ones you want to get. You know how it works. Ooh, this is my lips. So here's the swatch of it. Here it is on my lips. This is a very much my lips color. So it's actually kind of cute though. Now I'm looking at it again. Okay, so this crazy typey person is one of those trolls that likes to keep saying things, trying to get attention. You in the wrong space, honey. But thank you for engaging and giving me some, you know, time. Hey, Kim. So this is... Caramel Blondie, this is the first one. Here it is right here. It's okay. I can wear this every day. All right, so there's that one. Ooh. Right, the new lip ladies will love that shade. Now, next up is 502. This is Sweet and Salty, and that came on pretty good. I have actually tried these all on. Hey, Joshua. I've actually tried them all on, so I know some things about them, and we'll talk about it as I go along. <coughs> <coughs> so this is 502. This is sweet and salty. Here is the here is the swatch of it. So that was more of a pinky nude. This is more of a peachy nude. Now, and I like when they put it out because once you see all the colors coming out, this is a very much of a winter collection of colors. You know what I'm saying? It comes off, it comes off very, oh, these are some colors you, these are some shades you wear in the winter time. Like this is a nice nude and it's, but it's still kind of got that, you know, um, uh, you know, winter time, cooler time vibe to it. So that came on very nicely, you know, pretty easy to get on. So these are matte lip crayons. This one is not, it's still, it's like a um, a semi-matte. And now there are some that are ultra mattes in here because I've already tried them on. I will tell you which, this one is not that dry. It is not that dry. It is a matte, but see, I love a good matte. So I'm a matte chick. So if I'm gonna wear mattes, I don't mind them being that dry. But honestly, this is not that dry. There are some that are super dry in this baby. He trust me, I've tried them on. I was like, whoa, okay. All right, next up is 503 Hot Apricot. You know, I am a, put some balm on, rock your, uh, Rock you a nice nude and be happy. I mean, a matte, because I like, I, I'm not out of the liquid mattes, but I still love a good matte lipstick. This has got a little more coral in it, so it's a little brighter. So it's a little brighter on the lips. So it's a little, you know, give you a little brightness to your look. You know what I'm saying? Here we go. This is a little bit drier than those. Let me make sure I put this on. All right. We have not had any combos. Okay, so here's what's happening. Kim, we're going to do the swatch party. 
Now, if y'all want to have a little talk, a little chat afterwards, I will come back for a few after this, but we will end this after the swatches. Mainly because I need to like focus certain types of videos so they go faster. So we got that. Oh, your Atlas, honey, you got 17 names. You're going to have to like announce yourself like that. Just say Atlas. Because, honey, you got 17 different names on here. What you do get what you do get um get get in trouble because you got a 17 different i don't i ain't got time for clues child please i don't know where you think you at okay so this is little chili right 505 yep so this is little chili well you keep changing your name love and i ain't gonna be sitting up here trying to figure out shit i'm too old for that play that with somebody else now this is ultra matte and extremely dry this this is hard this is hard to get on I'm trying to play a game crazy just announced who he ain't got no time damn clue Oh yeah, this is super dry. This is super dry. Now it's pretty as hell. But this is ultra matte. It's, it's hard to put on. It's so dry. So if you don't like an ultra matte, don't mess with this one. Now let's see something because I'm about to drink some tea. Oh, it's gorgeous as hell, but it's super dry. Now look at this. I'm drinking tea. It honestly didn't stain it too much though. So it's a pretty good matte because you see it's barely. So it is matte and it should be as hard as it is to get on. Oh, it's going to stay on because it's hard. That is, that's a, that's like an ultra matte. That's like one of those, um, it's like Ruby Woo or something. It's ultra matte. I don't know. It's kind of, it's got some Ruby Woo. All right, bomb time. All right, let's go to the next one. 506. This is caramel brulee. Right, like clay. Okay, let me get it right. This is a cute color too, y'all. Now this one is much more creamy than the last one. This is like more of an orange red. Oh my gosh, she's cute. Oh my God, she's cute. Yes, yes, this one was much smoother than the other one. Much smoother. But I like them. Hey, y'all. Oh, let me get my stuff out. Let me get my stuff out. Um, I think they go on, because it's warm. Now, let me say this. These babies are warm, because it's in my room. So the, the room itself is, you know, a decent... Um, but I, what I think is that they go on better if you ha do have on a good balm. Now, the thing is, it's going to not be as matte sometimes. So make sure you use something like, if you're going to use a balm, use something like, you know, uh, you want to use a more stick balm. Don't use something that's very oily because then, of course, it's going to degrade it. But you definitely going to need a balm on with these babies. Okay, let's take this one off. Now, definitely on the, some are just more dry than others. This is my second time putting them all on. Same thing happened each time. So it's just about those particular ones 
are super. Uh, this one is Spice of Life. Hi, cousin. So this is Spice of Life. So this is spice of life. This is like in between. So this is not quite as dry, but not quite as creamy as the other ones. Yes, this is a muted Birky red. Thank you for the um, the description. Appreciate you. Thank you, Michelle. Appreciate you. Now this one came off just a little more. Let's see. Let's see. So you're getting a little off, but nowhere near what you would normally get off. So this one is Spice of Life. I honestly can say that this is a really nice collection um, because like the macaroons, Les Chocolat, they tended to be, um, well, macaroons doesn't bad. Les Chocolat was, they tend to be very light. A lot of times they have these super light collections that uh, I, I grab. I like this one because, and it's in this ultra, this, this matte crayon kind of vibe, which is kind of cute. I like the shaping of these. So I do like the shape of them. This one is Brulee Every Day. Okay. So now we're getting into these baritones. So we got that one. This one is dry too. This is, you know, I said there's a few of them that are kind of dry. Can't you tell how I'm trying to put it on? It is like hard to do. So this is one. That you would definitely have to put a good lip balm on. But damn it, ain't it cute though? This is like a more deep red. Now, I'm, this is very interesting because they have a lot of red tones in here. Right, it's like... <laughs> right, that's what I was just about to say that. That these colors do not correlate to the names on here and matter of fact they don't even come out the same because look at this one this is brulee every day right now the brulee um you know maybe they're going for the top hey lisa um but the top is usually like a brownish you know color from when they you burn the sugar on the top of a creme brulee this is not that's not this color so the, the colors are beautiful, but they kind of don't match what they're saying. I mean, just like this one right here is, well, hot apricot is cool. Um, I mean, some of them just like, what, huh? What, huh? What, 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 where are we going with this? What was that? Just throw, just throw, just throw a, a just throw a, a, a kind of a, a desserty name at them. That's all. Just, just throw a desserty name at them. Kind of French. Just throw a little desserty name at them. Make it French. It was like, you know, we're L'Oreal. Just, just use French names. You know. Right. We're, we're L'Oreal and we're a French company. Just make sure it says French. It's French, darling. French, it's French. Okay, here we go. Next up, flirty toffee. Let's put on some lip balm because we got to get the lip balm going. Um, okay. 
Okay. Oh my God, it's starting to get hot over here. I got the window open. Now see, this color is kind of what it is. Okay, so let's see. Put a little too much balm on. Okay, she's cute. Right, this right, this looks more brulee-ish too. It could be toffee or brulee. You're right. We got four more to go, and then we're gonna shut this one down, and then we're gonna go on and talk stuff. Cause there's a few things we want to talk about. Like she cute, right? She cute. Like some of those um, red ones could have been like some kind of cherry names, you know, could have been, there's a wealth of places they could have gone with that other than brulee. Oh, I love brulee. Call it brulee. Okay, this one is Trey Sweet. Now see, this is simple. Trey Sweet. It could be anything. This is very, um, this is very, uh, you know. Just we're just gonna throw a name on it. Trey Sweet. Just so, just throw a just throw a French name on it, darling. It's just, just we need a little French. We need a French name. Say Trey Sweet. Now I don't know why this wasn't in the earlier one. I like my colors. I like my colors to be in order, in succession. This should have been 501. I think they read they did this wrong. This shouldn't have been 510. This should have been 501. Because this goes in with the nudes in the beginning. I'm just saying, this is a nude. This is a nude, y'all. It's a cute brownie nude, but it's a nude nevertheless. It should have been in there with the peachy and the pinky nudes. You know, I can I can be a little ticky about those things. I'm I'm just a, just a tad bit ticky about those things. All right, this one is sizzling sugar. But even so. Five oh ten. Five ten five oh one. They got just I think we're supposed to be five oh one and they messed it up. Cause it goes from five hundred to five oh two. Now this gives me heroin vibes by Mac. It's just a deeper one. And I, hon I honestly like this one. I mean, I like them all pretty much. Honestly, I like them all. This is a really good range. But um, I got to be honest. I got a pretty much neutral skin tone, so I can wear all this stuff. Let's just be real. It's very few colors that I can't get away with at some point. You know, in the winter time I go this way, in the summertime I go that way. It's a it's a blessing and a curse. I'm I'm neutral. I'm right in that middle. Yes. Cause this is a little bit deeper. The interesting thing about heroin though, I would like to see how this works. Heroin looks so different on everybody, depending on your skin tone. Cause on me, heroin is very purple. Whereas I've seen it on other people where it is more, it's, it, it pulls a little more reddish, which I'm like, wow, okay, that's not the way it looks on me. Oh, what's going on in my eye? Yeah, I'm not feeling good. All right, now we have 515, no fig deal. No fig deal. I'm going to put a little balm on. We are down to the last two. 
Then we're gonna end this, and then we can come right back and talk for a little bit. I still got a little time I can talk. Ho, ho, ho. Okay, no big deal. Okay, so there's that, no fig deal. So this is the berry, got a little, a little berry in, up in here. What did I just do to my lip line? Don't look at me. Don't look at me. This is a little smoother. This gets a little deeper than the one right before. We've never seen a fig this color in nature. No, we have not, but they're figs, but figs in L'Oreal's nature, it is. Right. I don't know what they went. They just went all over the place. They have messed this up with this. We have, we've, we've established it's not the best idea, but color's cute. Color's real cute. And the last one is going to be Okay. Right. Cute. She cute though. Because figs are usually kind of brownish color. Just saying. All right. The last one is cher cherry, cherry fick. Cherry fick. Cherry fick. They call themselves. Wait until y'all see this one. Hang on. I'm going to keep it low for you. Wait till y'all see this. I'm not even gonna let y'all see the swatch. I'm gonna go low for this one because I gotta show y'all this one. <laughs> Remember, it's cherry fig. Didn't I say something should have been named Cherry? Here we go. I forgot there was one named Cherry. Cherry fig. Uh, okay, here's things. I think they messed up on some of the, the numbers. And I think they messed up on some of the names. Because this is more toasted brulee. And the other one should have been cherry fig. Because this is more brownie. This is more, this feels more like I think the names and numbers got screwed up because this is definitely should have been the the brulee and the other one should have been the cherry because that one was definitely cherry. Okay, so we have done the swatches. Right, they was like, oh, it's messed up. We're going to keep it. we just going to keep it. But now you know the names and the swatches. So here they are. So here they all are. So here they all are in numerical order. So here's the thing. Good thing I did the swatch party because you might look at those and not get the right color. Oh, Cherry, that sounds cute. And then come out with this. So the, the main thing is some of them are more drying the, than others. You have seen which ones are more dry. They are, some are ultra mattes. Some are, are mattes, more, you know, satin mattes. But they all are very matte. When you look at them on your lips, though, they're really nice. Let's see. Hold on. See, so you get very, very little is coming off, which is good. You know, especially, um, right. And then this one should have been up here right up in here so that one should have been up there so it's just a lot going on right okay so just know you refer back to this one before you pick up any because you might get confused <laughs> if you're thinking oh looking at the names and everything but i do think they're a good matte lipstick like i said they nice matte and if you want a matte tube lipstick not that expensive 
this is the way to go however they are twelve dollars so they they inching up don't buy them unless they don't sell because l'oreal has lost their mind i mean we always know that l'oreal has always been the more expensive side of lip of of um of drugstore but you know they getting out, out of they getting out of pocket wait till they go on sale these are 11.99 so you might as well wait until they on sale don't get them unless they are all right so that's it give me a second we're gonna go back in and have a little wednesday night chat so this is it for this one thank you all for watching thank you all for watching give me a minute and then i'll start a new one that will a fresh one that will be our chit chat our wednesday night chit chat because we got some shit to talk about <laughs>